every one of these. Uh, getting the, these immediate landing airs. Uh, one of the things uh, about the Syl uh, or Kane matchup that would make me want to switch to something like uh, Hodan is controlling this ground space. Giga, do uh, sorry, uh, Syl does not have a lot of good air to ground tools outside of uh, landing fair, and uh, landing down air is both risky and uh, stubby, where it just loses out to pretty much any tilt that Orkin throws out, F tilt included. And on Hoden, uh, on Hoden's side, he's got the landing air, he's got he's got pack air, air, down tilt, they all beat him out, and you get this much stronger to, uh, kill moves off the side, we're seeing it, uh, uh, Bicycle being forced into a much scarier situation with uh, Hodan down strong than you are any of Sylv's strong attacks. And able to cover the teleport with an air and getting it straight into the up B. First stock up the set going to Giga. The charge fair, it just is such an answer to most of Orkane's ground options. Like, as much, as good as down tilt is. Bigger than Sylv fair. And the <laughs> charge fair just answers so much of the horizontal. Looks for the flash kick, no dice, and just getting instantly into the down tilt into up air. Bicycle hitting his groove just a little bit. Another parry, but parry. both they've players. Been, they've ready. been screwing around with Hodan's side special and lag forever, and now it's just safe to throw out and then immediately rip a parry. Getting it down till up till. Didn't charge the dash attack enough. Get a couple back airs here from Bicycle. Who's looking to try and get his oh, no, special Just completely big, uh, beating out Bubbles. And another Yoinky Splinky. Oh, wait, no, that's uh, down, B, uh, down B fair. Uh, it was good. The doing your mom run. That's the confirm. I forget the name of the musician. I, I hate Rob. Huh? I hate Rob. <laughs> Look, just it's name not things normal. Please. No. <laughs> <laughs> I tried uh, convincing people to call uh, Pedal Wave Forward Strong the grandma because she's the only one getting hit by it. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> Kika starts to lap over bicycle in percentage, going for it again. That charge dash attack off stage. Ooh, and a drift yeah. back on the up beat. Not able to do it. Little too afraid of uh, that working up strong. All the friends are the, and we get to see the final stock. The air splash, uh, the, the air splash hitbox down special into empowered up B. Giga's ready. Giga is absolutely the player in, at least that I have seen, especially in the New York area, that is all about what can I do to, uh, to make this a niche confirm. Like, that's what he wants. The most, like, opportune confirms that he can, consistent or otherwise. What kill confirm can I do that makes my opponent as upset as possible? Yeah, like, I want... You get back, uh, you get back air down the uh, empowered fair on these very short side blast zones, but you're going to have some disgusting DI from Giga dying extremely early. Yeah, from, like, full stage. Full stage, forward strong. What's going on? You're a heavyweight, man. Getting the landing, uh, landing there into jab up tilt. Yeah, bicycle seeming to get in a little bit more of a comfortable spot now that he can flex these smaller blast zones on rock wall. Still, you say, and then uh, dies to yeah, he a, dies immediately. What was it? A non-empowered dash attack? I believe so. Yeah, it happens. It happens. You got, you got two stocks to work with. Especially when you have this ground game, but Giga playing, not able to get it. Giga playing so slippery right now. Like put into the put the Y axis to work, being as flexible as he can, comes down with that neutral special. Such a good landing option and a stair Lifting stall. away from the bubbles. Not able to get not working out for Giga that well. Look, another double there. With the drag down, down air into, the, I love the, the coverage, it yeah. really nice. Bicycle in a good flow, but the charge dash tech comes in, looking for these down tilts. Panicking there. Ooh, Ooh the parry down strong. Oh, the auto parry on it is And wild. getting the down tilt uh, empowered Pharaoh, seeing that a lot against Starbos on their off stream stat. Absolutely excellent forward air. Not able to get any, there's the bubble punish. The tech chase into awareness of the parry. Giga, ever patient when the parry comes out again for those sweat spirits. You see a huge down tilt starter. Could be massive. And Instead, just gets the wave land into jab. Nothing too crazy, but you know you're in a strong landing. spot. Bubbles 
just going for blood. Hopping up. Puddle in center Ooh, state. I was expecting, I don't know, a dash tag, any sort of match out there. And oh, catching off the top with up there. I feel like every set so far has been uh, a one-two punch back to even. Yeah, it's been a Game lot of just... It's always been 1-1. One, one. It's been a lot of scrambles back and forth. Both players kind of always establishing what they can do best, and then Game 3 kind of tilts the tide in one favor or in one player's favor or another. Uh, Bicycle getting very much time, uh, plenty of time to showcase what he is at uh, his best, which is all about ground coverage into juxtaposition for late game jump catches. Spirit tree kind of hit from Giga here. Right, right game three. I thought we were getting four. Right, game three. I was, it was yeah. one and one. I just I, I know. I, I said four, and I was wrong. <laughs> I'm aware of that. <laughs> Oh, a good start here again from Bicycle, who wave dashes back for that up to once Giga to really... Ooh, hello. Getting the down air. Unfortunately, uh, Bicycle had a puddle up, so he's able to recover. And the down strong up air? Who let this happen? Okay. Or came on out. Okay, it's about... <laughs> Down strong is a, okay. it's a button and a half. It's a, bu it's a button and a half, and oh. Not run ideal. Off The, prog the progress of this set has gone a little bit off the rails, though. Bicycle is certainly riding straight through the Waveland into the down strong, fully aware of the coverage. The Sweat Spear empowered on the neutral special is going to, to get some massive damage. Trying but... to get a cheeky up air after that dash attack and able to punish the teleport with an empowered up strong. Oh, damn. This, the venue getting a little bit Shot energetic. Shot Blast is going absolutely insane on, uh, on the commentary inside stream right now, and I'm really happy about it because I'm going to force him to do commentary for Upstate, and Giga <laughs> able to take the first stock of Game 3. Yeah, we're absolutely vibing here as Giga comes in, looking for a three stocks to one comeback, but 130% is always difficult. Behind, trying to punish Bicycle's, uh, Bicycle's puzzles right there with a parry, unfortunately not able to get it. Bicycle just gonna... Yeah, that was good. You can't let those lingering nares. Meaty opportunities are few and far between in Rivals 1 because of how accessible parry is. As long as your opponent's able to react to it, I need to adjust my headset. <laughs> as long as you, your opponent can react to it, those meaty opportunities will get absolutely blown up. Giga considering the stage, going back to forest floor. Got some ground to, to run around with, preventing, uh, preventing Orkane from really getting in all too much. Letting Giga develop some space here. Maybe throw out a few sweat spirits. Just gonna keep doing wave, uh, wave dash jab. Not able to convert into the down air. There's that big Bicycle charge able to swap there. back. Not able to get the charge fair that time. Always tricky for Hodon, who wants to kind of have these big offstage plays. It's hard Ooh, to not getting down the arcane. charge up special. What's going on here, Giga? The Hot. down strong. Wave dash down strong as a chase. You're not rolling away from Hodon. In, not in this game. This game number two, it's all Giga to start, and it's all Giga to uh, seemingly to uh, the finish. Giga showing you that Starbos ain't no fluke. Not in the least, though. This said. It's, it's Giga's opportunity. He wants to bring this to a game number five. He's not going to let us bicycle. The opportunity, able to cover that landing with the neutral special there. And charge good parry on the uh, charge fair. But the bubbles rock a nice keeping control of the space. Ooh. One fair going back to stage. Always making sure that he's playing close to stage, especially with the puddle online and to seize the puddle. Ooh, oh my no. gosh. On the right side, no SD this time around from Giga, though a little dizzy from that return to stage. Covers the sweat spirit into an immediate fastball. Wait, down, down strong. strong. Back even stock. Bicycle so ready for any and all of these platform landings. He knows whatever move he hits and if it's going to set up for a tech chase or not. Whoa. Huge parry again. Amazing hitboxes are just, they are free pickings for a player if they're ready. And there it is again, waiting for the parry on platform and just letting rip it up special. That's twice now. He has seen the landing into a parry on plant. Giga fully aware of a very particular Ooh. defensive habit. We'll see how just how much he's able to exploit that, especially, I, especially since it's now been hit twice. Ooh, the landing up air, not gonna get it for Giga. I loved what, uh, what Bicycle was doing on flat there, using uh, a bubble pop to force a really bad tech situation from Giga. 
Yo, that roll into the corner was nasty from Giga, but Bicycle still in this. Attack, not able to link to the, the Empowered Fair. Flash kick. Oh, there, there it is. is. Charged for that extra hair to try and wait out the parry timing, and it worked like a charm. Finding that stock on the very, very charged up strong to bring us to a game number five. Thinking about Hoda and just sitting there, towel on the back, just going, come on, come on, come on, come on, do it, do it, do it, do it. You want it, you want it, you want it. Die. <laughs> He's got his towel in the water, waiting for a nibble, and Orkane gave it up. Oh my God, the pop off from the venue again. Sidestream is kind of, kind of going crazy right now. Sounds As like Gertie's going absolutely insane. Up 2-1 on Akashi. Side stream. Silvano stop 8? Silvano stop 8? Silvano stop 8? Could be. Could be more realistic than you think. Solo Silvano is more important. That's he's a little, a little bit of a traitor here. <laughs> oh, gotta have the Hodan in the back pocket. You, gotta, you need that pocket Hodan for people who aren't that faithful to Sil. Big down tilt there. This is a great start for Bicycle. Ooh, the up air empowered fair. Patience from both sides, but he finds the up air. tilt. Up tilt, up air. A classic from Orkane. Always going to be as consistent, especially on bigger bodies like Hodon. Got that extra bit of gravity. Yeah, edge guard. Ooh, Ooh trying to. Oh, Not the miss parry punish. The game five shivers. This ice water is freezing. Hodon's built for hot springs. Oh, big parry again, and this time he's not miss missing the punish, but he's so far behind. Nice sweet fair. Ooh, not able to punish that teleport. Catches. Didn't even have the empowerment from the uh, from the puddle. Has to burn through the sweat spirits in order to get back. Spending all of this time into the fast one to the platform just to take a minimal little punish. Nice awareness from Giga as he the read with the forward strong. These, these uh, teleport reads are not working out for Giga here, sitting on potentially his winner side stock. That's not even. This is this is elimination oh, point. Oh, this is losers, crap! Yeah, this I is, forgot this was losers, stop it. This is set point for Bicycle. If you you take this stock, you walk into losers fifths with no worries, but your next opponent. Meanwhile, Giga trying to make a miracle comeback here, takes the first stock. After that solid gimp using the charge fair, and you're able to get down with 16% to move. A little greedy with that uh, that tornado there, not able to get anything off of it. These dash back uh, turn around or forward tilts, uh, not forward tilts, down tilts are insane. Ooh. Same can be said for Giga though. Insane patience, the Abari coming out from the front bicycle. Oh, there's the teleport read. Yeah. Finally, Giga on point. And covering with the, the sweat spirit, not even. Early that time. Oh, We're not allowed to praise him for, for covering teleport anymore. He's yeah. just got a deal. Bicycle is Ooh, on point with strong. all of these different timings as we see him cover a yet again a fastball to Wilbur. Down, down, down strong! Down strong! That Take seals it, game out. five! That seals it out. How many times did we see the platform coverage come out from Bicycle over and over and over again? He was fully aware of the reaction tech chase on those platforms, committed to the Orcane down strong as a coverage option, and the, you know what? It consistently ends up working. It's a game plan that he followed through with towards the end of the game of the set, and he wins at game five over Kika. Excellent stuff from Bicycle. Amazing stuff. But that, for sure this time, will do it for us here at Hitfall number three for top 16 and a flavor of top eight as Bicycle, excuse me, not Bicycle, Bicycle moves on to Loser's Fifths. Hit the gritty for Ukraine, takes it over Akashi to make it into top eight. So that locks in our next Loser's Seventh match, which you will see with Akashi and Cyberhex.